This build is sponsored by wood to works where you can get quality woods for your luthery, turning and carving needs. They ship worldwide and have a great service to help you choose through their great selection. So you can, now you can see the layout for uh, the thickness curves that I that I created. Uh, the holes have been drilled to different depth on my drill press using the curvature of the already carved bottom. I was able to put a gap on my drill press and then drill the different uh, thicknesses that I need for this. So now there's a lot of material to remove, especially on the outside. 
and just uh, dealing with the inside uh, with the gouges my hands were like really really aching uh, I, I worked on that last week and gave myself a week to actually uh, recuperate uh, doing a mandolin uh, is already hard but I can do both sides uh, usually but this uh, just the sheer size of this one uh, what I'm gonna try to do is um, be creative and probably use a maybe a number four plane and try to remove some of the bulk of the outside before I actually go back with the the, the gouge on it. Uh, there's also, I've seen people using the drill press uh, with uh, putting holes everywhere, like a bigger drill bit and putting holes everywhere to remove the bulk. I've tried that in the past and what I, I don't like is like when you have two holes and then you hit it with like a gouge or something, uh, you end up having a lot of tear out on the bottom side. So I would like to stay away from that if possible. But if uh, I find that my hands are really really hurting again I'll probably try that
So at the moment the back plate is uh, pretty much all shaped. All I need to do is do some extra final sanding on it. Uh, there is a bit of a spring back and that, uh, as you can see right now, and that happens when uh, you remove the wood and then the tensions are popping back into uh, the plate. So in order to prevent any further uh, change, I'm going to uh, clamp it on the back here of the instrument because I'm not going to be able to work on it for a couple days. So once again I want to thank you all for stopping by and watching this video. This uh, back plate was uh, pretty pretty hard to carve. Uh, my fingers are going to be aching for a couple of weeks. But uh, uh, So the next step I'll be installing the point, the binding on the points. I will also be uh, making a video on tuning the backboard. And then uh, once the points are made and the backboard is tuned, uh, technically we should be able to uh, make the glue up there. So. Uh, I also want to thank uh, Bow River Wood Two Works. Uh, do check uh, their website. They provide wood, uh, this quality type of wood. Uh, once again, amazing uh, quality, amazing service. Thank, thanks again, Bow River. Um, don't forget to like and share this video. Uh, you can also follow uh, the many steps of this build on either Instagram or Facebook. I really appreciate your time, and until next time, I wish you well.